So this is how you can activate FaceTime hand gestures. Now, I can't directly show you because it's going to turn off my mic if I'm in a call, but what I can do is show you the website. So let's go on ahead and open it up. And this is what you should see. Before we do this, make sure that you are in a call so that you can turn it on or off. Now, what you're gonna want to do is scroll down your control center like so, and tap on the FaceTime button at the top. It should appear when you're in a call, so you can go on ahead and tap on it. And now this is what you can see. You have privacy and audio and video. So under audio and video, you're gonna want to tap on this reactions button. Make sure that it is highlighted in white like that. And now you can use reactions or hand gestures. Now, how do you actually do these gestures? Well, it's very simple. Here are three of the easy ways. You have the hearts, the thumbs up, and the thumbs down. Surely these are all very common gestures that a lot of people know already. You just make a heart with your hand or a thumbs up or a thumbs down, and it's going to show these effects. You could also do these effects like fireworks, rain, and balloon. Use both hands as a thumbs up, use both hands as a thumbs down for a rain, and a peace sign in order to get balloons. You can get confetti by doing two peace signs, and you can get lasers by doing this hand sign with two of your ending fingers going up and then the two middle fingers going down. So yeah, that's pretty much it. If you don't want to do these gestures, you can also just simply tap on the reaction buttons that will show up when you're in a FaceTime call. So that's about it for this video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and let us know in the comments down below if the tutorial worked or if you have any questions. Thank you and goodbye.